God bless you. Thank you for joining us this week. We are Abundant Grace Church. I am Bishop Ramon Di Maria, and I'm the senior pastor of Abundant Grace Church. For prayer or information about our church and outreach ministry, you may email me at abundant.grace at att.net. I hope and pray that you are enjoying this new year, 2021, and that God is truly blessing you. Our message title this week is Obey God in the New Year. My scripture will be from the book of Isaiah, chapter 1 and verse 19. If you are willing and obedient, you shall eat the good of the land. My beloved, in the 11th century, King Henry III of Bavaria became tired of his responsibilities as king, the pressures of international politics, and the mundane orderliness of court life. He made an application to Prior Richard at a local monastery to be accepted as a contemplative and spend the rest of his life in prayer and meditation. Prior Richard responded, Your Majesty, do you understand that the pledge here is one of obedience, that it will be hard since you have been a king? Henry said, I understand. The rest of my life I will be obedient to you as Christ leads you. Prior Richard said, Then I will tell you what to do. Go back to your throne and serve faithfully in a place where God has put you. After Henry died, this statement was written in his honor. The king learned to rule by being obedient. So my beloved, today and every day, you have these following decisions to make. One, live by your own impulses or live according to the instructions God has given you in his word. Two, go according to your own best thinking or submit yourself to the rule and the leading of the Holy Spirit who lives within you. So my beloved, when you think about it, the answer is clear. Obeying God leads to peace, progress, protection, and promotion. His word says, if you are willing and obedient, you shall eat the good of the land. Note the words, willing and obedient. Obedience is an act of your will, not a reflex of your emotions. So this year, my beloved, do what God says, for he has good things in mind for you. Let us pray. Father God, in Jesus' name, we desire to be willing and obedient to you and your word. Instruct us, lead us, and guide us in the path that you have for us while we live in this present life. Speak to us through your Holy Spirit. Lead us, guide us, and when we get off track, convict us so that we may get back on track. Be with us, keep us, strengthen us, and endow us in your understanding. And we pray this in the name of our Savior and Lord Jesus Christ, to whom be glory, power, and majesty, now and forever. Amen. My beloved, continue to have a blessed, great, and productive year 2021. Please keep on listening. God bless you and go with God.